Cody Brown over. Trap of law, Mary Brown drops breaking news, it will shock you. In a surprising twist for Sister Wives fans, season 18 spoilers have unveiled Mary Brown's latest move, shedding light on her post-divorce journey. The 52-year-old reality star, known for her tumultuous relationship with Cody Brown, has apparently taken a significant step in reclaiming her individuality. Mary's new legal name, a symbolic ornament on the Christmas tree. The revelation came as Mary casually adorned her Christmas tree with a new ornament, bearing her updated legal name, Mary Caroline Davenport. The change from her previous last name, Brown, has sparked curiosity and discussion among the Sister Wives community. Fan reactions on Reddit, embracing the change. Sister Wives enthusiasts quickly took to Reddit to share their thoughts on Mary's decision to adopt the name Davenport. One user expressed surprise, asking, Mare has officially changed her last name from Brown? Another praised the new name, stating, Mary Davenport is such a good name. Mary Brown is plain and may. A third user applauded the change, noting, it's much more suited to her first name. Happy to see this, Mary deserves to be her own self. Season 18 Spoilers, Mary Brown's Bold Move to Utah the latest season of Sister Wives brings Mary back to her roots in Utah. Her decision to relocate her clothing business and integrate it into a bed and breakfast venture has been a focal point of the season. The announcement of her move met with mixed reactions from Cody and Robin Brown, with Cody displaying indifference and Robin pleading tearfully for Mary to reconsider. Exploring new connections, Mary's social life post-divorce. Fans have observed a shift in Mary's social life, noting her company with various individuals. While some have speculated romantic connections, others highlight her close ties with gay friends. Mary's recent Instagram post features her alongside interior designer Blair Struble, igniting speculation and interest among followers. The end of an era, Mary and Cody's divorce confirmed. Sister Wives Season 18 spoilers confirm the formal end of Mary and Cody Brown's marriage in January 2023. Reports suggest that their relationship had been on shaky ground for seven years, emphasizing the challenges they faced leading up to the official separation. As Mary embarks on this new chapter, fans eagerly await further developments in her journey of self-discovery and independence. Share your thoughts on Mary's last name change and her evolving story in the comments below. The cohesion of the Brown family appears to be unraveling, and this development is hardly breaking news. The unraveling of Cody Brown's marriages has been an ongoing narrative for several years. Viewers of the reality show Sister Wives have been privy to the signs of discord within the family. In 2014, Cody and Mary Brown took the step of ending their legal marriage, marking a significant turning point. The challenges between Cody and Janelle intensified during the pandemic, adding strain to their relationship. The year 2021 witnessed another chapter in the family saga as Cody and Christine decided to call off their relationship as well. At present, the only remaining marital tie is the spiritual marriage between Cody and Robin. Speculations are circulating that the couple might explore a monogamous relationship. To gain insight into the reasons behind these developments, it's best to hear directly from the individuals involved. Cody Brown, the patriarch of the polygamous family featured in the reality series Sister Wives, has expressed his concerns about what he perceives as a lack of loyalty within the family. This revelation comes to light as members of the Brown family engaged in a reflective exercise, watching footage of their commitment ceremony from 2013 and offering commentary. In a poignant moment captured in a video shared with People, Robin, one of Cody's wives, became visibly emotional, shedding tears and nearly breaking down as she implored to halt the playback. Distressed, she removed her microphone and requested a break from the emotionally charged scene. Mary, another of Cody's wives, echoed a sense of regret after viewing the footage. Expressing frustration, she remarked, I am so mad at us. Every single one of us. We failed ourselves. This candid admission suggests a collective acknowledgement of shortcomings within the family dynamic. Even Christine, who has made the decision to separate from Cody and the family, 
expressed a sentimental attachment to certain moments. She noted that despite her departure, there are days, like the one captured in the commitment ceremony footage, that hold a special place in her heart. The unraveling emotions showcased in the video provide a glimpse into the complexities and challenges faced by the Brown family. The issues of loyalty, regret, and the impact of individual decisions on the family unit appear to be at the forefront of their reflections, adding a layer of depth to the ongoing narrative of the family's dynamics. As the sister wives continue to navigate their intricate relationships, viewers are left to ponder the future trajectory of a family facing internal strife and the weight of their collective history. In the intricate tapestry of familial relationships, the mission statement often serves as a guiding beacon, encapsulating the collective aspirations and values of its members. Janelle, in echoing sentiments shared by many, emphasized the profound emotional investment each family member made in crafting their mission statement. We all poured our heart and soul into the mission statement, she remarked, underscoring the depth of commitment the family had invested in their shared vision. Janelle's introspective reflection delves further into the family's commitment to cohesion. Recognizing the complexities inherent in family dynamics, she revealed a thoughtful decision to enlist the services of a family counselor. This proactive step speaks to a collective understanding that maintaining familial bonds requires not just intent but also strategic efforts to overcome challenges. I resonated with it, Janelle added, alluding to the emotional resonance she experienced upon revisiting the mission statement. This sentiment hints at the mission statement's significance as a touchstone for familial values, suggesting that, despite any discord, the core principles embedded in the statement remained a source of connection and shared identity. On the other hand, Cody's perspective adds a layer of complexity to the narrative. He expressed admiration for the inspiration behind the mission statement, highlighting its initial impact on the family. However, his subsequent admission that they just failed to abide by it introduces a sobering realization. Cody's acknowledgement of a failure to adhere to the values outlined in the mission statement raises critical questions about the challenges the family faced in translating intention into action. The poignant admission that there just wasn't enough loyalty in the family lays bare a fundamental issue that transcends mere non-compliance. Cody's reference to loyalty invites contemplation on the nature of trust and commitment within the familial unit. Whose loyalty fell short, and in what ways did it impact the family dynamics? Cody's words open a window into the intricate dynamics of trust and allegiance within the family structure. The unraveling of loyalty, a cornerstone in any cohesive family, suggests fractures in the foundational bonds that hold individuals together. Was it a matter of conflicting priorities, divergent paths, or a lapse in communication that eroded the loyalty Cody believed essential? As we navigate the complex terrain of family relationships, the story of Janelle and Cody prompts a broader reflection on the challenges inherent in maintaining unity. The mission statement, conceived with passion and purpose, stands as a testament to the family's collective vision. Yet, the acknowledgement of failure to uphold its principles reveals the vulnerability of even the most well-intentioned endeavors. In the pursuit of familial harmony, it becomes imperative to scrutinize the nuanced interplay of loyalty, communication, and shared values. Janelle and Cody's journey serves as a reminder that the path to a resilient and united family involves not only the creation of inspiring mission statements but an ongoing commitment to living out those values, fostering loyalty, and addressing the inevitable challenges that arise along the way.